evening viewer welcome to our glory globe tv here's a breaking news yes designing earth observation systems is an exercise in trade offs a satellite may be good at collecting data in fine spatial resolution at high temporal frequency or across a broad range of wavelengths but not all three at once ground based systems such as weather stations can collect a variety of data frequently but they sample only one location and their distribution is uneven across the planet there is another vehicle for collecting earth observations one that can fill gaps in weather and climate data the animal kingdom over several decades tens of thousands of creatures from strokes and caribou that is called caribou to elephants and elephant seals have been tagged with sensors to gather data about their habitats this include places that are too dark cloudy icy or forested for satellites to see or are too rock remote or in hospital for humans to access increasingly scientists are realizing the power of animal observations to improve climate monitoring and reveal earth processes in finer detail animals are an integral component of earth observation said ecologist diego el soto a graduate student at yala university and nasa finest investigators in nasa earth and space science and technology fellow in a recent paper in nature climate change alice soto and colleagues lay out their case and a vision for making animal tracking data part of the standard toolkit for studying our planet to start consider how just one species in one part of the world can collect data with unique spatial and temporal coverage the maps above compare temperature data acquisition by satellite and by elephant born sensors in a portion of south africa's kruger national park the land surface temperature map displays an yearly average of morning temperatures collected by the landsat 5 satellite the other map bottom shows year temperatures from the same location and year recorded multiplied times per day by elephants fitted with sensors a cluster of data points appears along by mayam bhubu river here satellite data covers the entire area but is limited by spatial resolution revisit time 16 days in the case of landsat 5 and other factors such as cloud cover additionally ground based weather stations collected data at high temporal frequencies but from static points far away from the elephant's location the elephant born sensors log data at high frequency but sample different territories along the animals voyages the map below shows the patterns and extents of elephant movement across kruger national park for one year bien the report glory globe tv delhi bharat